Hi guys, um, today is Wednesday, I think. <laughs> Don't know the date offhand. Uh, Bill and a friend are here helping, and today's the day we put the greenhouse up around the RV. I call it a greenhouse. It's just a big tarp. I've got a video, a vlog, uploading right now from Monday, and I'll connect it obviously to my to my um what's the word blog anyway and uh so big work's going on now Maisie you're zoomed in a little bit so that the outside looks like what I see but anyway loves Bill that's Bill my son-in-law with his arms up and Maisie thinks the sun rises and sets on Bill. So she's kind of going a little bit crazy. She wants to be with Bill. Look at her looking at him with adoring eyes. Well, she just thinks Bill's a cat's pajamas. And of course, this one's just looking for something to bark at. He's on the ladder doing something with a skill saw. Uh, I think he's trimming the branch down. Pretty sure that's to keep the tarp off our thing. Now we won't be able to um, see as well out here once that's up, obviously. It's clear, supposedly, but it's not clear enough that we'll be able to see very well. So, it's mid-40s today, and, uh, yeah, it'll be a good day. We should be much warmer after this, because we'll be in a greenhouse. <coughs> Maisie, enough. <coughs> but Bill's coming down. Okay, anyway, I'll show you later. I'll be back. Well, I guess it won't be. Too bad. What I was seeing before was two layers of it, but you can kind of see a little bit through it, which is pretty good that, you know, we can at least get to see the sunshine. That's a big thing. But it's not, you can see through a little bit, see hazy shapes. Maisie says, what's hazy shapes, Mom? So that's our big project. As you can see, where it's single there, you can kind of see through it, which is adequate. Because to watch the wildlife and stuff, we'll look out the front window, which is open. They cut a hole, and this tarp is a lot bigger than I thought it would be. It probably didn't need to be nearly this big. I could have saved 100 bucks, but anyway. Um... It is what it is. But yep, looks good. I left the curtains closed behind the birds. I didn't want them freaking out with the stuff flapping in the ladder and all that. So I'll open that and they can say, oh my goodness, what happened to our view? So I'll end it here. It's just our big project for today. And uh, when I say ours, I mean I didn't really do much. Um, Maisie got out, got to run around a lot because she loves Bill, and apparently she loves his friend too. She got out and got to do some running around, chasing, and what he was throwing the ball and stuff. Now she's laying here panting. She got a lot of exercise with her Bill. So Lyra used to call Bill my Bill, <laughs> and she was little. Our
So anyway, I'm going to go. Um, next time I have a picture, I'll share it. You know, of how, how it looks and whatever. Or I'll do a walk around or something. So I will see you guys later, next time, whenever. So have a happy hump day. Take care. And God bless. Well, there we are. Snug. That's a temporary opening at the back. That's all snug. There's going to be a zipper door right there. And, uh, there's our dinners. Okay. And there's, we got to get more steaks, apparently. Apparently we got to get more steaks, so. Okay, firewood. Huh? Yeah, I'm thinking they did it sideways. But it all worked. Just have a lot of extra at the ends. You can see how much extra is in there. That's pretty cool. Last shot of the river before I go in, I gotta walk. I might as well walk around this way. It's gonna be a long walk either way to get back to the RV, into the entrance. I've been doing a lot of walking today. That big log that's right down there. And the river, usually you can't see any air under the log. It's usually up about a quarter of the way up. So the river's low right now. And I don't know if that has something to do with the dam or the dam upstream or what. And there's the other part of the lot down there. It's probably half acre down there too. Anyway, this part Maisie likes to run around on. So, whoa, lots of roots and I'm in my bedroom slippers. There it is from the back, and here we are. Pretty cool. I think it's going to be very effective. Like I said, the main thing is to stop the wind. And uh, when the sun's out, it'll create a little more heat under here to help save on propane. We keep our furnace at about 58 we keep our heater, our electric heater, our Dyson heater at uh, about 66 to 70. Depends how windy it is. But the Dyson, whoops, sorry. That's all the stuff. It's got a, but the Dyson heater is... Um, very efficient, so, okay, bye.